some exciting product launches and unveiling happening here. Uh, Scott Belsky actually said it's not about the ideas. In fact, it's not only about the ideas. It's about making those ideas happen. And uh, let's look at some fantastic ideas and meet the people who've made it happen right now. Uh, let's go on to our first product launch. Uh, this is a startup that's set to drive a new movement in electric mobility. They're going to unveil India's fastest electric motorcycle right here on the stage of Tech Sparks 2016. Uh, we have on stage the founder of Talk, Kapil Shelke. Kapil, welcome on stage. Kapil Shelke, founder of Talk. Technology does not suffer standing still. It has no interest in conforming or recognition of established norms. It is under no obligation to make sense to you. It is here not to obey, but to command your wildest imagination and question your farthest boundaries. Technology is the sound of fingernails on the freshly impossible. The wind that howls merrily amidst the creaking boughs of our perceived reality. It is forever young, forever unbridled, forever new. For where life is an endlessly changing vista of wide-eyed wonder, the seasoned and outworn have no place. They are mere relics relegated to nostalgia, forgotten figments of a bygone age. The future is here, with racing boots on. Keep up, or get left behind. Good morning everyone, this is Kapil, I am the CEO and founder at Talk Motorcycles. What I am going to do here today, I am going to present a revolutionary product. This product is going to set a benchmark in the electric vehicle space in India. The product, as you know, is an electric motorcycle. We call it the T6X. So let's start with very basic questions about motorcycles first. So what is a motorcycle? Or what makes a motorcycle a motorcycle? Is it the shiny exhaust? Is it the rumbling engine? Or a clutch lever? Or what would this make an electric motorcycle then, which has got none of the above? An electric motorcycle is something that you would love to drive without the complexity of a petrol engine. It is for the consumer who craves for speed. It has got instant torque, no vibrations, and super, up, super acceleration. When you have all this, electric motorcycles are kicking up dirt in the staunchly traditional market. Why would somebody who loves the thundering sound of their exhaust, ride an electric. There are 40 odd reasons I can give you right now about the T6X. But I'll just start with basics. And I promise not to go in, in the saving the future boring lecture. The electric motorcycle will have some merits over a pedal motorcycle. First, it is got superb acceleration. To understand this, we'll have to understand how a petrol engine works. A petrol engine usually has progressive torque. That means you have to rave the engine to 6,500 RPM to get the 15 Newton meters of torque that a 150cc motorcycle provides in India. By the time you do this, it is already late, and you're not getting the complete torque. There's one more thing that I would like to say, is an electric motor gives you all the torque 
at zero RPM. That means now you can accelerate from the point zero, even before moving, it, it has all the torque on your command. So it will give all the torque for you as a rider. And this will keep on continuously until you reach 60, 70 kilometers per hour. This is what I call scary. There's one more thing that I, I would like to mention. Petrol motorcycles aren't allowed to give you all the power they have. When I say aren't allowed, actually not allowed. Because they're choked by the stringent emission norms. They have put themselves into the world of catalytic converters and restrictive exhaust. As the emission norms will get stricter, they will have to move towards less power and more into emissions. And the fuel economy has to rise. With electric engines, we don't have to do anything of this. There's nobody looking over our shoulders. We have all the power that I can give you. Clean, instant power at your command. This torque is what you're going to feel from zero RPM. All this power for you right now, rare, on the motorcycle. Now I have broached the topic of fuel economy. I have to tell you that this is super efficient. But to understand it is super efficient, you'll have to understand what a petrol motorcycle does, or a petrol engine does. A petrol engine will have to suck air and fuel into a combustion chamber, then compress it, then burn it, and then take it out as a residual part through the silencer. By the time it does it, does that all this, it is only 20% efficient. 20. So that means you're putting in 10 bucks and you're going to get two bucks of forward motion. And that has been the complete case for the last 100 years. Yeah, there's been an improvement. There were steam engines and there were petrol engines. But I think this has to change. An electric motor is 90% efficient. When I say 90, it's almost close to 100. So you put in 10 bucks of fuel or electricity, it will give you nine forward motion. This is fantastic. This is what we need as riders. This is what will kick up, I don't know, how, what I say to petrol motorcycles. It has not been a case that we are introducing this as the first electric motorcycle of the world. There have been companies who have been doing this for long. Tesla, zero motorcycles, have shown us a way of what an electric motorcycle can do, or electric vehicles can do, and with style. There are one more case I would like to share is it is not just the product. Electric vehicles have been racing. They have been racing at circuit, which are the most difficult circuits in the world. One case, an electric motorcycle blew up the competition by 10 seconds. When I say racing, racing means for one second it is one year. So you see 10 seconds, you imagine. We at Torque have been also racing. We've been to the TTX GP Isle of Man. Isle of Man is the mecca for motorcycle racers. It is the most prestigious and the toughest track in the world. We went there in 2009. In our first outing, we stood third. In the second outing, we stood first at the TTX GP Championship. This is that way race-winning technology I've packed into the T6X. There's something, there are always questions. People like to ask, what will it take to, uh, or does an electric vehicle move fast? Does an electric motor have pickup? Or does it have power? I would like to start with pickup. One more thing, pickups come, pickup will come from torque, not BHP. An electric motorcycle can give you whooping 27 newton meter of torque from 0 to 100 and keep it there. Next thing is speed. When I say 100 kilometers per hour, this is India's fastest electric motorcycle to date. When I say, I, I know what you're thinking. 100, will actually give 100? 
it will die at 85. It will start creaming at 90. But no, when we say 100, it is a cruising speed of 100 kilometers per hour. This motorcycle is going to be scary fast. This is what I like. It is going to be insane. There's one more thing. Top speed, okay? Now, there are certain factors on this motorcycle that we've built for just this motorcycle. So, a lot of people usually ask us, how long this will go? It will do 100 kilometers on a single charge. And it will take only an hour to charge that. So once you've charged in a day, you do not need to charge it again. I will give you your own personal fuel station at your place. T the T6X has got a TFT touchscreen. It is inbuilt on this motorcycle. This motorcycle will have an integrated GPS display, Bluetooth, which will connect to your phone and tell you what the motorcycle is doing and every other information on this motorcycle. Charge status, how long it will go, what was your ride, how is your ride tomorrow, climate, lots. And that's not, not just all we have given. It has got cloud connectivity. Maintenance is a very big issue when you're comparing a petrol and electric. An electric motorcycle does not need maintenance, zero. You don't have to worry about valve change, oil change, all this stuff. You don't have to. Electric motorcycle. This motorcycle is going to be connected to a cloud. And what we're going to do is we're going to gather all the data from this motorcycle. My engineers are going to call you up and say, I think this is not working fine. We should come and check your motorcycle. They even might visit you on a Sunday. But we are going to come to you. When we started building this motorcycle, connectivity was a big issue. We wanted to build connectivity grounds up. But there are certain factors of the motorcycle. We wanted to keep it in that way. This motorcycle has a frame inspired from our racing heritage. It has got a trellis frame, which is light in structure and sturdy. It has got a powerhouse motor, which is just 6 kilowatts for 6 kilos. It will propel you to 100 kilometers per hour. This also has Dual compound tires. Nobody's thought about it. We said we have to work on this. It'll have harder tire compound in, in the middle. That will give you longer range. Softer at the sides. So you can lean this beauty in the corners and flee planted. We want to give you a motorcycle that flies. I've talked enough. I have to show you the beauty. Let's bring it on.
I want to give you the best price. So we are going to launch this, unveil this, at a promotional price of 1,24,999. That's the beauty, that's the price. Go online, pre-book this motorcycle today, get into the club of thought. We will invite you to test rides, we will invite you to our conferences, get this motorcycle, pre-book this, right now. Thank you.